once again I'm pleased to be able to be here to say or do something to help further the work of God. I'm still feeding on last week's program. That was tremendous. I wish that everybody could have actually met up here that day. I believe if you get close to the spout when glory comes out, yeah, you get right. And I'd like for everybody to be able to squeeze them in this little place and, and really felt what we felt up here. Amen. And those that might there have been weak, would have gotten stronger. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Those that didn't know the uh, yeah. Lord in their lives would have felt that conviction yeah. power. They yeah. would have had to yeah. because that spirit was so strong that, you know, but that was last Sunday yeah. and this one is this Sunday. Yeah. Yeah. And we've got to go on with what we've got yeah. today. Yeah. My little bite of life today is called simply, Seek Ye. Seek ye. Yeah. And I started, when I started thinking along these lines, I thought, well, what does seek actually mean? I mean, what's the, the definition of it? And I went to look at it. it. says to go in search or quest of. To seek the truth. To go to. And to seek a place to rest. Yeah. Now I'm going to read Isaiah 55 and 6. And it says, Seek ye the Lord while he may be found. Call ye upon him while he is near. Listeners out there today, he's been near to you. Are you seeking yes, That's right. I believe you need to be seeking yes, yes. I'm not going to call a name here. I'm going to give some uh, initials and they'll, they'll know what I'm talking about. JJ, you need to be seeking Thank you, Lord. You attended our service last Sunday night and you didn't answer the call. But he hasn't given up. Well, that's him, Lord. He's going to call some more. You need to be seeking him, JJ. Zephaniah 2 and 3 says, Seek ye the Lord. Don't forget, we thought talking about seek ye. So seek ye the Lord, all ye meek of the earth, which shall wrought his judgment. Seek righteousness, seek meekness. It may be ye shall be hid in the day of the Lord's anger. You know, right now, the Lord is our Savior. But there's coming a time when that same Savior is going to become a judge. That's right. And while we, we react to these seeking calls that we've had, to this conviction that we've had in our hearts today, I know you've had it. I felt it go out. I know that somebody listening today is under conviction. Amen. Amen. But that same Savior that's offered to save you today will one day be your judge. Okay. When he talks about when all eyes shall behold him, that's talking about the ones that don't even believe in him now. Mm -hmm. oh, and he's going to tell you to depart from him. I never knew. You talk about some sad words that you could hear. Depart from him. That's right, brother. I never knew you. That's right. And if you don't realize the full impact of that today, that day, you'll realize as you stand on the edge of the lake of fire, mm -hmm. I never knew you. That's right. Are the saddest words you could ever hear. Matthew 6, 33 and 34, But seek ye first the kingdom of God and his righteousness, and all these things shall be added unto you. Take therefore no thought for the morrow, for the morrow shall take thought for the things of itself. Sufficient unto the day, is the evil that are you know there's a song that was made pretty famous I, I didn't think the lady that sang it but uh, one more day or something to that effect uh, anyway it, it's talking about uh, the one day that we live today we have to get through this one day at a time uh, we have to get through this day and then tomorrow We'll face tomorrow with renewed vigor. Because if we've got the Spirit of the Lord in our lives, He'll give us strength day by day to mm -hmm. overcome what comes our way. Man, what are you going to do today? Are you going to continue to sit on your easy chair, your feet propped up, <coughs> or are you going to start seeking? Are you going to start going in search of or a quest of to seek a place to rest? You're not going to find rest on this earth. Yeah. There's always going to be something you're going to be reaching out to, something you want that you don't have, because in Jesus Christ, the Prince of Peace 
is the only place you're going to find rest. Seek ye after that. Amen. Praise Amen. the Lord. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord.